Father, we ask that the angel on God will be released now. Amen. Angel of faith will be released now. Amen. To give us understanding. Amen. To give me her trance. Amen. To distribute blessing. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This morning, Lord, do what only you can do. Amen. In the life of your people. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. We are so generation. We come for to show His excellence. All I require, all I require for life, God has given me. I 
Let's read from the word of God. Esther chapter 2. Verse 9. Then verses 15 to 18. Esther chapter 2. Verse 9. And verses 15 through 18. I will read from here. As I'm reading, let the Yoruba people follow us. And the maiden pleased him. And she obtained kindness of him. And he speedily gave her her things for purification, with such things as belonged to her, and seven maidens, which were meant to be given her out of the king's house. And he preferred her and her maid unto the best place of the house of the women. May you be preferred this morning. Amen. Verse 15 now. Now when the turn of Esther, the daughter of Abihel, the uncle of Mordecai, who had taken her for his daughter, was come to go into the king, she required nothing but what Agai, the king Sambalin, the keeper of the women, appointed. And Esther obtained favor in the sight of all that look upon her. So Esther was taken unto King Ahasuerus into the house royal in the tenth month, which is the month of Tebet, in the seventh year of his reign. And the king loved Esther above all women. May you be loved above all people. Amen. 
and she obtained grace and favor in the sight more than all the virgins, so that he set the royal crown upon her head. May you receive the royal crown this morning. Amen. And made her queen, make her queen instead of varsity. Then the king made a great feast unto all his princes and his servant, even Esther's feast. And he made a release to the prophecies and gave gifts according to the state of the king. Amen. Amen. Let me just add more, one more. Psalm 102, verse 13. 102, verse 13. I read. Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. Your set time has come this morning. Amen. You are a candidate of his favor. You want to see on your for you really. Favor is divine as as grace at some more of fair and grace also divide as unmerited favor ben ya to more ori of ege bi oju ere ti a si so grace and favor they are equal nitori you na know, ori of ati oju ere okan na ni won and it is the grace of god that make one to be grace be si ni ori of e olorun ni won so yan de nla when grace sees greatness will stop it is grace that makes difference is love of man. We may be age mate, we may be classmate, but we are not grace mate. Because it's the grace of God in one man that makes a difference. May the grace of God locate you this morning in the name of Jesus. And to be candidate of God's favor, to be candidate of uncommon favor, you must first be favored by God. God's favor precedes men's benevolence. Without God's favor, you end up in labor. Labor without corresponding result. And of course, you know, labor and favor, they are not equal. What is favor? Favor is a benevolence bestow on a person even when he is not qualified. A act of kindness that gives you what you are not qualified for. Undeserved kindness. Favor is it is an amazing grace of God upon man. It opens door of special success and supernatural breakthrough for man. It gives you a fruit and splendor. Favor is God's supernatural intervention in man's life. The supernatural ability of God in action, doing the impossible in the life of man. Just like suddenly a slave of yesterday became a king. Or probably like Joseph, a prisoner of yesterday became a prime minister. Just in a thinking of an eye. May God's favor locate you this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When we yeah. talk about favor, favor is a spirit. And you cannot get it instead to receive the spirit of God in your life. It's the spirit of God given by God. 
but there are four precursors to favor. Yes, to receive man's favor or common favor, you need these four things in your life. Number one, you must, you must know God by salvation. Very, very important. Because Jesus Christ himself is the favor personified. You can't have God's favor and be rejected by men. You can't have God's favor and be ignored by your boss. Proverbs chapter 14 verse 9 said there are favor in the camp of the righteous. So when you are connected to God by salvation, you are sure of God's favor. The kind of favor that your enemy cannot handle. Today, God will grant you that kind of favor. Number two, Ikeji. You must seek for it in prayer and public confession. Matthew chapter 7 verse 7 says, Seek and ye shall receive. You must seek in prayer. In the face of God for favor. Because prayer provokes favor. Prayer is a booster of favor. And you must consciously ask for it from God. If you don't ask for it, you cannot get it. Because favor is an accelerator of destiny. What favor can do for you, no man can do it for you. And number three, it is you must be you must be good and be merciful to other people. In the book of Matthew chapter 5 verse 7, Jesus Christ said, Blessed are the merciful for they shall receive mercy. When you are showing mercy, you are bound to receive mercy. Mercy a favor is like flavor. That make your life to be flavored. And of course, you know when something is flavored, it will taste good, it will taste sweet. With a peculiar aroma. So when you are merciful to other people, you will receive the same mercy. Don't know Everyone favored by God is under divine grace to be favored by men. In the book of Luke chapter 1 verse 30, it was the favor of God that fell upon Mary that made him to become the mother of Jesus Christ. When the angel saw her, he said, that woman, you are highly favored by God. And the miracle she was not qualified for was attracted to her. This money, I said, you will receive favor of God in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And therefore, every goodness you are not qualified for shall be attracted unto you in the name of Jesus Christ. Those who are favored in the Bible, they are just numerous. I want to you to the Those became the prime minister by God's favor. Ruth, who was a Gentile, became the grandmother of Jesus Christ because he received God's favor. Ruth, who was a layman, was eating at the table of the king because he received God's favor. Daniel could not be destroyed in the den of lion because God's favor was upon his life. David also received favor to become the king. He was brought from the wilderness to the throne. David cannot. Oh no! May that favor fall upon you this morning in the name of Jesus Christ. And number four, divine purpose brings divine favor. Because God is committed 
to whatever he has commissioned. You will join divine backing when you are working divine purpose. Those four things are very important for you to connect to divine purpose. I want come many one you want to I pray this morning. You will not miss the favor of God. Amen. I said you are not going to miss the favor of God. Let me tell you what to stand to gain. Because if you don't know the importance of favor, you may not know how to lay hold on it. Very, very important. Favor of God deliver you from the sword of men. Favor of God is to effect change instant changes in your life. Just like, like Jacob, who was a supplanter and overlined, he became the fathers of nations. May that favor come upon your life now. Because favor will take you from the background to the forefront. Number two, favor will destroy frustration of life. When Peter was frustrated in the book of Luke, and he, when he was fishing, I could not make any cash. He was frustrated, disappointed, dejected, dull and drained. But favor personified. Jesus Christ appeared and he plugged onto him. Of course, you know the story. At the end of the story, he made a multitude of cash. That he alone could not pull it out. And that is what is going to happen to you this morning. Then favor bring the poor before the king. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the book of Psalm 113, verses 7 and 8, Bible says, Favor of God will bring you out of the dung hill to sit down in the throne with palace. David was brought from wilderness to the palace by favor of God, and as soon as Saul saw him, he loved him. David was It was favor of God that took Esther and often a slave from nowhere to somewhere to become a queen. Hear what my father said about this matter. My mentor, our mentor, he said in his book, Blessed to be a blessing. Page 56, second and third paragraph there. He said, Esther's story painted a very clear picture of God's favor. He said, a slave girl became a queen. He said, the God of mercy was with her and granted her favor in the sight of everyone. End of quote, Pastor Dr. You are now. I want to pray for you this morning. As you are going away from this convention, the favor of God will come upon your life. You will receive favor from everyone you meet on the way. In your office, you will receive favor. On the way, you will receive favor. In the market, you see favor. In the church, you see favor. In your ministry, you see favor. In the name of Jesus Christ, come on, shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Favor accelerates the rate at which prayer is answered. Isaiah 65 verse 24 says, you are making your prayer, God will answer. Even before you finish that prayer, God will answer. 
Esther in the book of Esther chapter 7 verse 3. Esther, you know Esther or KJ as a keta. He asked for something difficult. He asked for her life and the life of her generation. And it was, she was granted. You may not understand it. Meaning that he was about changing the story of, of, of that city. Because the law of media and partial is unbreakable. And that law had been enacted. Because she prayed and asked for her life, but God was changed. I pray for somebody here this morning. The natural law that puts people down in your family will be broken because of you. That cause in your family that will not allow people to lift up their head this morning by the favor of God this has been reversed in the name of Jesus Christ. That cause of lateness, that cause of barrenness, that cause of early death, this morning in the name of Jesus Christ, they shall be reversed in the name of Jesus Christ. So the cause of this was changed because Esther was living under the favor of God. When you are under the influence of favor, or in total power of favor, your petition cannot be rejected. Even when you ask for hard thing in a difficult time. Let me go first at number five. Favor justifies you instead of condemnation. David, David fornicated and impregnated the wife of Uriah. And by scam, he killed Uriah. And when God brought him to the court to judge him, to try him, God himself brought him to judge him. Do you know what God said? God said, <laughs> You should consider what God has done for you. If you consider what God has done for you small, you will have asked more. God was telling David, if you consider what I've done for you small, you will have asked for more. What else can God do for David? The whole kingdom was in his hand. And God said, if you think that what I've done for you is small, why can't you ask for more? Favor justifies. Today you shall be justified. Hey, hey, hey. I said you shall be justified. You shall be justified. Whatever the law condemning them in your family. By the favor of Jehovah God. You shall be justified. You shall be justified. You know, Satan has just has condemned some family. Satan they must die young. That is the conclusion of the devil. But this morning, by God's favor, you shall be exonerated. I say you shall be exonerated. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, lead up your hand and sound fire. You know, favor can turn a great man to a great man. A great man to a great man. Somebody said there are two GM in every society. I want to show He said we have the great man and we have the general manager. But overnight, the favor of God can turn a great man to a general manager. This morning, no matter how low you are, the favor of God will bring you up. 
I said, the favor of God will bring you up. Hey, my Lord, you don't know hey, I said, the favor of God will bring you up. Oh, you okay. In the name of Jesus. Look at Jesus. Promotion comes by God's favor. Psalm 75 says, Promotion does not come from east, from west, or from south. Despite all the injustice and the crookedness in the world, when you are favored by God, nobody can deny your promotion. Therefore, Everyone here this morning that are qualified for promotion, come on, take your promotion in the name of Jesus. The favor of God will qualify you in the name of Jesus for your next office, for your next level, for your next office, for your next level in the name of Jesus. Favor change rule and change social status. Esther Esteri. who was a slave, anything she became queen. within a tick of an eye. So favor brings honor. Because when your social status change, everything about your life will be upgraded. Those who have been sending Esther here and before. I want to tell Esther in she became the queen, they worship her. Want Because her social status change. May your social status change today. May your honor come today. I said, may your honor come today. May your honor come today. May your honor come today. In the name of Jesus Christ. Listen, you know, it was favor that found her out. When she appeared before them, a man in charge, a guy. And it don't want to die for everything she will need in that. And when she was appointed as the queen, everything about her life changed. So when you have favor locate you, your life will change. Your clothing will change. Your money, the money you spend will change. The kind of food you eat will change. Your friendship will change. Everything about life will change. May you be located by God's favor. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. All right, let, let me give you a case study of this of this little girl called Esther. When you are disfavored, you are defeated. Automatically, you are defeated. But when you are fighting with a favored man, you'll be destroyed. You will just destroy your destiny. You will not understand what made Esther to be so favored until you know her story back home with her uncle Mordecai. That everything that saw her begin to respect and gave her favor. Her uncle was a gate man. At the, at the gate of palace of King Ahasuerus. And one one day. The king lifted up a man called Aman to become his left hand. And he saw so command that everybody in that domain should reference him and bow down. And everybody in that place began to reference and bow and prostrate for him. But Mordecai, Mordecai, the father of Esther, Baba Esther, refused to bow. Hello? Hi. Do you know why he refused to bow? He said because he said he was a Jew. That terminology was a Jew. That word Jews. It's just like when you say you are born again now. To be a Jew is to be born again. To be a Jew. 
is to know God and know him intimately by salvation. To be a Jew is to be a member of God's family. To be a Jew is to have a relationship with God. And that is the foundation of God's favor. It is fundamental. The relationship with God is superior to any other thing. And the law of God, the Bible says you must not bow down for anything. No, no graven image, no human being, even not the image of God on the head. So, Mordecai decided not to bow down. Hello? Hi. Are you getting it now? Because if you are a Jew, if you are born again, you are favored. And when you are favored, you are number one. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Amen. When he was coming from the gate, and saw this man, Mordecai did not bow down. He was annoyed. And he decided to destroy him. And he can't think to be an instant to destroy him alone. Let me destroy every person that connected with him. He want to have an encounter with a man that is favored by God. And he went to the king. He manipulated. And he said, King, there are some people in this place, they didn't respect you. Let us kill them. And I, I will pay money to your coffer. And the king signed it with his signet. So the law had been enacted. And of course, you know the law of media and pressure cannot be changed. And they printed the flyer, they distributed it. And Mordecai happened to get one of the flyers. And he took it to Esther. Of course, you know the story very well. And he told Esther, you must write to this occasion. Don't forget that Mordecai and Esther, they are favored by God. And Esther Esther decided to provoke divine favor. Esther is what You know, I told you that prayer is a provoker of favor. And he told his uncle, oh, tell all the men to begin to fast and pray for me for three days. I myself, I will go and fast for three days and three nights. And after the fasting, I will go into the king. Which is contrary to the law. And if I perish, I perish. But she will not perish. And you will not perish too. I said you will not perish too. After the third day, after he has provoked divine favor, Esther went into the king without invitation. And every female gender that entered the palace without invitation. Will be killed. And that is the time that Esther entered the palace. As she entered the palace, he saw the king on the throne. And he saw the sheep by his side. And the sheep, they shook their head. Uh, it's a pity. This girl will die this morning. This girl will die this morning. I don't know what people are saying about your life. I don't know what they are saying about your life. As, as the king saw her, she was coming towards her. On top of her. And, and on the throne, At the Lord, there, are, there are two scepters. I want to come to you. Two scepters. We have the scepter of authority. And we have the scepter of peace. If the king raises up the scepter of authority on anybody, he will be killed. And if he raise up the scepter of peace, he will be spared. So all the chiefs, they were ready to carry Esther and go and kill her. But as Esther was getting closer, the aroma of God's favor was coming up. Aroma of favor was coming. Aroma of favor was coming. You know I told you, when you are flavors, you have a divine aroma. Esther was flavored by prayer and fasting. 
that flavor entered the nose of the king. And the head was strong. Instead of taking the center of authority, he took the center of peace. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And instead of being king, she was she came to wrap her hand with her husband as she was hugged. She was welcome. Instead of death, it was life. Whatever anybody is insinuating about your life, God of heaven will change them this morning. Instead of sickness, I be sound head. Instead of death, I be life for you. Instead of troubles, I be peace for you. In the name of Jesus. You can See what favor can do. And the king said, I know you didn't come here like that. You need something from me. You just ask me out to the half of my kingdom. And I will me. give it to you. Do you know what God said? In the book of Job, God said, Demand a thing. Ask me a thing. And I will do it. That's God for you. The king said, ask me to the half of my kingdom. But God is saying this morning, your demand for something that is going to do it for you. And King Wenda said, it's not too much. I'm just happy and I want to throw a banquet. And I want to come and eat with me. It will be a long time we head together. But when you are coming, Please don't come alone. Come with your left hand. This man come with him. God has given Esther a divine, a divine strategy. Divine strategy to destroy the enemy. I want And when the day was, the, day, the second day came. They went for the banquet. One love and the head. Oh, they enjoying the food. Oh, what bad one, you know? And the king said, No, I know there's something in your mind. You must ask me what you have in mind. Oh, what the and Esther said, No, it's not too much again. To, tomorrow again. Oh, la, la, to come, and eat, come and eat with me. And when you are coming, to one ball, come with Amma, your left hand. You want to man, the so they, they left the place. What and they were coming out. And Emma was going to his house. When he got to the gate. But what there nobody? Everybody was bowing down. But we want terrible. And a favored man, Mordecai, stood still. And he told you, you're not going to teach Mordecai what drug with dick. He said, yeah. Only yeah. All this enjoyment is nothing to me. Go boy, but do your jack come for me. As long as this boy is here, he's not, he's not worshiping me. Me want to buy a bad talk, but he told terrible from bad. I must kill him. Mordecai. And he went home. Oh, our Lord. He was consulting his friend. Oh, one by one restaurant. Talking to his wife. Oh, by one restaurant. Of course, you know the story very well. Emma, you know that. And they said, no problem, you are, the, you are the assistant king. Go and tell the king to fast track the day of their death. And because of that, he couldn't sleep over the night. He developed hypertension. High blood pressure. I want to say to somebody here, every enemy that determined to see your head, they shall develop hypertension. There's a high blood pressure in the name of Jesus. Lord. And you know what? Favor, 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 favor. And as he cannot sleep, the king too cannot sleep. And the king was thinking, what happened to me? My wife has done so much. And suddenly he said, okay, okay, bring me the book of record. And they began, and they began to read. The book of record. Where not he? And they were reading it. What thing? They got to a portion. What they become? That mentioned the name of Mordecai. Let us know the Mordecai. That reveal the secret of the rebels who want to topple the kingdom of the king. Don't fear, Shiri. I want lot. Don't fear. By job, I love all. By full stop. And the king said, Wait. About you, I drum them. What have I done for him? He said, Nothing, sir. He said, So I am a debtor. Ah, I want to go all the graduates. So somebody in this town, I must reward him. This morning, God will reward you. I said, I will reward you. 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 And God said, King said, okay, what can I do for him? I'm happy. I am happy about this man. I must do something about him. 
As at that time, it was getting down. So a man who could not sleep was coming urgently in the morning to come and report and change the date. As at that time, he was sitting in the general palace. And the king said, go and look around. Who is around to come and advise me? And they got there. They saw a man. It's even good. This, this is the assistant. And the assistant. And King said, bring, bring him in. And he was brought in. When he was brought in, the king did not allow him to say anything. The king said, I, the king, are serious. I am happy about somebody in this time. What can I do for him? What can I do for that man? And the man just stood still. He said, who will the king be happy about? Yesterday, he invited me to banquet. Last month, he has made me to be an assistant. It must be me. But he was wrong. Your enemies have been wrong. And he said, I, I, after I'm an assistant, if the king departed, I'm the next one. Let me begin to step into what is not my own now. And say, oh, you king. That's your mighty barbari guy you used to wear. What's in the year? Let it be put on that person. Your shoe. Put on him. And let him be carried to your horse. I'm giving the, the set of authority. Unless one of your noble chief begin to pardon him around the city and begin to announce him. And say, this is the man that the king is happy about. Hey. And the king said. The king said. You have said where? Quickly now. Listen, see. Quickly now. You are the noble king. Go and do the same for Mordecai. Go and do the same for Mordecai. Go and do the same for Mordecai. Hey, 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 hey. From this day, your enemies are serving you. Your enemies are serving you. They will worship you. They will worship you. In the name of Jesus Christ, lift up your hands and say, Fire! Fire! It doesn't stop there. Now, let's see. A man must not allow the king to know that he's not happy. A man, you walk by by like a pair, cut him up, no more doom. He cut it urgently. Oh, what shall it be? They went through all the city. One local carry a ring, no. When they came back, but the one who had it, he had to slink out to his house. All that you are your carry, that they could not let you. I believe all the hair will be full of dust. Mom, my boy, you only just go for a look. As he was getting home, but one day, he reported to the wife. Oh, one fed just so. If you are not careful, we die for this boy. Ah, boy, but you are a woman. Could you ever call him? He has not taken back, take his bath. When the king sent an entourage to go and invite him for the banquet. That I want to tell you, see me. Beginning from today, your enemies shall not be at peace. He, he couldn't have time to rest. And he dressed up and he followed them. Now I'm running off now. When they go to palace, they went to Queen's Palace. But what they are feel about. When they go to Queen's Palace, but what they have here, Queen Esther has spoiled the ground. I have bought the palace with different kind of food. What if you are going to go on the palace? Hallelujah! I praise the Lord. Women, and your belly. If you don't know how to cook, do and learn it. But I'm about to say the local because food delicacy is part of the thing to attract your husband. Don't you feel a lot better, local? Hallelujah! Hallelujah! So, so they sat down to eat. But the white chocolate is genuine. And the king said, "Now you must ask me. Me, so what do I bid in? What you want? Quickly, quickly, quickly! He said, "Eat first, eat first." After they are eating, let you enjoy. Now Esther now lay down. This Esther is walking. My dear husband. You are my queen, my lord, you are my everything. If my life is precious to you, and the life of my people in this city, can you please save my life? And the king laughs, say, nobody can try your life. You say, somebody has tried it. Who is that person? Nobody can try it. They have tried this. Who is the person? And he pointed to a man. This is rebel man. And the king stood up. Oh, what did he? Yeah, yeah. He ran to the palace. Oh, what? Lost his feet. 
Before he came back, this is the end of the message. Before he came back, a man knew that he's in trouble. So he was to beg for his life. He was beg for his life. And in, in Palestine, if you want to beg for your life, you need that and wrap your hand on the feet. And lay hand on the person. But when he was done to do it, he was done to do it. 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 He was done so it is true. So Tony, it is true. Oh Tony, you want to rape my wife in my presence? Oh, the Lord is here. Oh, oh. You know what happened? Oh, what man does it? All the chief around. But we are one. You think better? You can't. I knew that trouble was coming. One more, we will let it down. And they say, please, sir. Why we job? Don't be annoyed. I'm not being. Let's do one thing. There is a gallo. He can't lack on what that he has planted behind his house. Let's not even mind. Let us go and hang him there. Take a love, we come there. The king said, "Abba, we pray." I close my eyes now. Come on, say, did you mean before I open it? Don't lie. Let it be kind and urgently. Mr. Sir, say, hey. Hey, as from today, let your nilo every instrument of your enemy. Don't go in the shower, tarry. Every instrument of your enemy. Don't go in the shower, tarry. Let go. I'm going to fight them in the name of Jesus. Let your nilo. I want you to pray. Move it up, bad boy. God, my time is gone already. I'll come with the lapin. You will pray. Oh, bad boy. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Every anti-favor. Every anti favor that is surrounding my life this morning, let them cast fire. 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 Limbrato sa Alright, in Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen. One more quickly now. Oh, you will say it this way. Oh, Baba, every favor. Oh, Jude, the Bobo. No one has ever enjoyed in my family. Me. In the name of Jesus, I step into it now. I step into it now. Oh, Baba, I step into it now. Oh, in the name of Jesus, Lord, Jesus every favor oh, that nobody has ever enjoyed in my family, I receive it now. Oh, bye -bye. Open your mouth and receive oh, it. Oh, yeah, let me go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me go. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Jesus, Oluwawa. Hallelujah. 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 You want to um, offer a prayer for yourself? Offer what God do? I can't find a rebuy. Genesis chapter four, verse fifteen. We just sorry, Kerry. S K Dogun. Fifteen P. Abalake G S K Dogun says, and the Lord set a mark on Cain. Also, we pray. Oluwa Sami siara keni lara so that nobody should kill him. Nitori eni tio bari kio ma ba ba. Not everything in Cain was bad. Kin shombo kotoa no kaini ni odao because God set a mark on him. 
Now you want to ask God. Speak to God. Oh Lord. Set a mark of favor on my forehead. Fear me, me. So that everywhere I go, to make I shall be favored. I must be favored. I must be favored. Everywhere I go. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Jesus, Oluwawa. Open your eyes. I did not plan what I'm going to do now. When I came here, what was me? The Spirit of God told me to do something. I sanctify this oil as the oil of favor. Amen. Now, what you do is to contact me. Yes. I am representing all of you. Here. I said, I am representing all of you here. So put your own finger on the finger. Father, we thank you for the message. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for your servant. Thank you, Lord. Who has delivered? Mm. Effective message. Thank you, Lord. Brought us favor mm. from your throne this mm. morning. Mm. We mm. thank you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now I stand here and representing all the participants. In the name of even Jesus. Even those that are watching us afar mm. off in other countries. Mm. That I stand here, that every one of us, I want you to uh, use your left hand. Stretch your, for, your, for, your, right, your left hand on me. I mean, stretch toward me. No, while I fear, I me. Father, every one of us here, by the grace of the Almighty God, who gave favor to Mordecai, who gave favor to Esther, who gave favor to David, every one of us here set a mark of favor. Amen. And I, I anoint every one of us here with, anoint, with anointing of favor. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. By the grace of God. Yes. And by the anointing that is upon me. Amen. Wherever you go, mm. you will be preferred mm. above your colleagues. Amen. You shall be favored. Amen. Wherever you go. Amen. You shall be favored. Amen. At home. Amen. In your business. Amen. In your academics. Amen. In everything you do. Amen. In your ministry. Amen. You shall be favored. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Say, I am favored. I am favored. So wherever you go, I want you to confidently go there. If people say that you are not qualified, with, with confidence, go there and say, God has favored me. He has set on me. He has set on me. The mark of favor. By the grace of God. In the next three months. Every one of us here. You will give testimony. Amen. Amen. Wow. In the next three months. Amen. You will give testimony. Amen. 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 I'm walking in power, I'm walking in miracles, I live a life of favor. Yes, I 
Ayo, ayo.